fire in the room. Hello? What's going on today? What can I do for you? Well, obviously, I swung too wide on the roundabout and did a recycling room. Okay, you guys are coming through the roundabout? Yeah. yeah. I was going this way, he was coming this way, and yeah. he was in my lane coming straight to I, I went around it. I went to slow down, and it just... All right, Good job so for you. Sir? I'm Tom Henry. Yes, sir. I just do the. Oh, okay, I'll that's do, good enough. I don't do that for the COVID. I understand. So you guys must want to stand over here closer to the car so we don't get hit. So which which? It was me. So you're just coming out of the roundabout and you're yeah. on Old Mill. I, I went around too yeah, wide. Yeah, I was going this way. Okay. I, I thought I hit made the around. curve and I didn't. Okay. That was my fault. I, all right. Alright, the officer, the officer in route's going to need a uh, driver's license and insurance card. Sure. Absolutely. Okay. How many people in your car? Just my wife and the niece. Business card? Oh, nope. Just a well, that's good. driver's license. No driver's license? And insurance card, auto insurance. I don't know the health insurance. Oh, that, oh, that one's a little. Which one? Oh, yeah. Well, I don't know which one it is. Pick that one. That's the auto insurance. That's yeah, your. That's I, your health insurance. Well, I don't know which one it is. Uh, Thank you. Hello. You need game cards. Here we are. That's your health insurance card. That's the well, one you're trying to get. I'm sure by the city. Jesus Christ. That's my wife's. I'm not sure about it. 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 I'm not sure You're insured by the city of Fort Wayne? Do you think? I don't know. I don't know how that runs. I understand. But I, yeah, I'm insured by the city. Okay. Take That's a the city car? That's the yes. Oh, okay. Okay. Hi. So, all right. I that's your health insurance card. I don't need that. That's yours. Is that mine no, or yours? That's okay, yours. I'm sorry. That's why I don't go. All right, stay here. This officer's going to take over the investigation here. I don't know how you want to do this, but he was driving. He, he was driving and he came out of the roundabout. The woman was going southbound. He came out of the roundabout too wide and hit her mirror. Right on. So does that mean you got three transport? Are we going to need a supervisor to do that? I'd probably have a good one. Very much, 541. Um. Well, well, careful. No, 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 it's fine. My wife needs to write home right now. She's very ill. She has cancer and she's very, very sick. She needs a ride home right now. She needs a what? A, a ride, ride home. home. A ride home? Uh, yes. 
Okay, I'll get a unit out here to take her home. I'm the mayor. God damn it. Take her home right now. Steve, I don't care who you call. You take my wife home. You want me to take her home? Yes, right okay. now and with lights and siren. Where's home at? What's the address? Out in the north part of northwest part of town. Off of Harris Road. Off Harris Road? Take out right now. Okay. I'll be on Steve back. Okay. Right now. Take her home. I hear you, Mayor. Let me get your address. You want me to take your license, Irons? I don't care. Yes, please. She's she's very, very ill. I took her home for the first time right. tonight. Stand over here. There's a car coming. Yep. Stand over here. Just Thank you. Right now. What's I'm the address? Take her right now. Okay. I'm going to show what it takes. That's okay. order. In order. All right. Yes, sir. Which one's your wife? In the front passenger. King three five six. I'm being ordered by the mayor to take his wife home. Lights and sirens. King three five six. I'm clear. Ordered by the mayor. Take his wife home. Lights and sirens. Three, five, six. I'll be nine here shortly. I'll relieve you. Nope, that's orders for me, he said. I'm Cindy. Cindy, I'm Julie. This Marty. is Marty. Marty, Hi. nice to meet you. Um, my car's all the way back here, so I'm going to have you guys step okay. out here. Okay, okay. I've got soup with Thank you so much. You're welcome, ma'am. No problem. Thank you so much. No problem. Your mother? No. Oh, Cindy. Cindy. Okay. It's, she's too old to be my mother. Oh. I'm going to have you step back here with these officers. Um, we're going to go all the way back here. That way we don't fall in other cars. Did that officer that chimed up a minute ago? Or are they going to hit? That's all. Right. We understand, but we care about you too, though. Uh, we have a call for the mayor. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Julie, are you giving both of them a ride? Or if, if not, as I say, one of us can. That's your wife, and who else? My wife. Yeah, who, who else? My wife is the one person. Right, who, there's two over there. Who else is over one's there? One's my wife and one's my mother-in-law. Gotcha, okay. Tell me, pick one, which one's one? No, no, I just didn't, you kept saying your wife, I didn't know who the other one was. No, my wife. Gotcha. She's the one who's hurting. She's the one who's what? I'm sorry? She's the one who has cancer. I gotcha. And we took her out for the first time tonight. Obviously, we were at a fundraiser and I probably went over the line. It's, it's me. I gotcha. I'll, I'll take whatever the line on. But it wasn't just a pass around or whatever. I'll take it. I got you. Where'd you guys, you said it was a fundraiser? Oh yeah, Pacific Theater. Pacific Theater? Yeah, and I, I, took, gotcha. I took our mother-in-law home and we were coming back and I probably went around the damn traffic circle and too wide and hit somebody side view mirror. I got gotcha. you. You were driving then? Yeah, I was driving. It is what it is. I got gotcha. you. Damn traffic circles. I love them, but I hate them. <laughs> yeah, they're not much fun. No, but they're not. Especially when you, especially when you go too somewhere. wide and somebody comes in too thin and you knock off their rear view mirror. It's... Yeah, I... My wife went nuts. I wiped out on that one. Oh, no. She said, you've been drinking too much. And I said, oh, for God's sake. We were there for five hours. Listen to a laugh. <laughs> See, they're laughing at us. No way. I'll take, I'll take whatever hit. I hit me it's her I'm worried about most. It's unfortunate. 
Who stole my car? Who? Who stole my car? Is it my car? Okay, it's your car. <laughs> I was going to say, who stole my car? Can I check on my wife, see how she's doing? No, nope, she's just about to leave. We have an officer that's taking her home. Okay. Yeah. She's got to get her in Okay, yep. She, they're getting ready to leave right now. She's just getting the car all cleared out for them. Good. Thank you. So she'll get her home safe and sound and Good. get your mother-in-law home too. Good. Yeah. I'll, I've, obviously, I'll take responsibility. I swung too wide and I swung too wide. And I think she was going straight and I was going, I think that's what happened. Either I was going straight and she was going around, or I was going around and she was going straight. I can't quite remember those two, but whatever it was, I hit her in the side in there. I got you. Ah, oh, god dang it. There she is right there, my wife. You see it, Diddy? She's a pretty lady. She is. I'm going to go say hi. You know, stay over here for me. Just hang out here. There's a safer for you to see right here. Stay still in one spot. All right. We have quite a few accidents on roundabouts. Mm. Not down here. Not I usually. With Marty, with Marty Bender, I, I ask him from time to time, you know, we're building all these roundabouts. You know, how many of them are really effective? Uh, Do we still have a number of accidents? I just know this one. I'm, we don't have that many down here on this one at all. Yeah. Well, I've been to like one, maybe. Oh, really? So, yeah, I mean... And that's it? Yeah. I might sometimes come down here and try to go well, my wife was My wife was telling me that, you know, she goes in these roundabouts like at Goshen and Sherman Swanee's. People just fly by, <laughs> and they don't understand you yield to your left. Right. And they just fly by, and she said several times, I've had to slam in my brakes. I, want, I wonder how many... I was going to talk to Marty. How, I wonder how many accidents you've already had with roundabouts. Because people just don't understand you yield to your left. Right. I, I don't know the answer to that. I, I wouldn't know either. Is this your regular shift? Yep. What was the fundraiser for? Civic Theater. Not only that would have been fine, but I took my mother-in-law home. We are coming back. Yeah, I'm not down the south part of town very often. You what? I'm not down the south part of town very often. Gotcha. This is not my area. <laughs> so, went around about, obviously I swung too wide. I, I think she's just getting them situated. They're in the car already. Yes, yeah, she has a real so. medical problem. Okay. That's why I was going to head over here. She's not. She shouldn't have gone tonight, but she did to support the Civic Theater. Which she shouldn't have gone. Over. I gotcha. I was willing not to. Go That's why she's. It's one of the reasons we left. Let's get this thing right. We're just waiting for my sergeant to get down here. I understand. Let's let's get the sergeant moving. I'm serious. He, he's on he's on he, he's on his way. I don't give a shit what it is. Let's get going. I got a wife who's in serious medical problems. I can't screw around this. What's the problem? Who's the quadrant leader for this area? Quadrant leader. Tonight it's Sergeant Chief Wilkins. Hafner, the deputy chief. Hafner. Hafner. Steve. Yeah. He's the deputy chief for the quadrant. Is he on duty? No. You're doing what you need to do, I understand. But obviously, when you get a family infected, I got you. Involved, you're involved. Oh, she yelled at me because I was, I was I was hurrying to get her home. So it's time for an insulin shot. I got you.
Who's that? That's our sergeant. He's just turning around. Right. Let's get him out of here. Do it if you need to do it. Actually, I'm I'm more I'm more afraid of my wife. <laughs> Aren't we all? Aren't we all more afraid? I was of trying our to get her home in time for her shot. Oh God, I'm getting I'm getting oh shit. Hi, honey. Right behind you. Who is? Honey, that's okay. We we have the police car taken. Huh. Hmm? What? Weiss. I pulled up on it. I'm out of the police ship. Weiss is pulled up on it. I know. Yep. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you. She said my car is not. The city car is not. Driveway. Your car is not? That's what she says. Okay. Let's well, go, let's go here and take a look. Nope, hang out here well, for where me. Where is it? Hey, sir. It's up here? Nope, I just need you to hang out here for me. There we go. Just hang out right here. I don't want you getting hit by a car. I know. So if you just hang out here, he's getting caught up on what's going on and. I know. 379, King 385, the signal 43, and the 375. Um, crash. He's, um, I'll stay on his feet. He's all over the, losing his balance. Broadway. Uh, uh, you see the team? No, I didn't know that. Uh, on the scene. Yep. Yep. Or anything like that. that it goes on. Taylor, uh, he's stuck in on breath mix one after another. Right. Sure. He asked for his license, he gave me his business card, I said yes, business card, and he gave me his, I said, well, you can keep that, and kept asking for his auto insurance, he kept looking for it, then he realized that he's got, he's driving a city car, it's city insurance, and I said, well, I didn't know it's got a personal plate on it, so I didn't know it was a city car. Any, uh, breath stuff? Just breath mints. So I can smell them one after another. steady and steady and sound speed. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm going to have you do. I'm going to have you stick around. I just want you to hang back. That's fine. Uh, I want you to do whatever there. you want me to uh, do. We'll need a report tonight. Your overtime's approved. Um, everybody else and me, we're going to take care of this. Okay? So, I'm going to have one of them give him the PPD. <sighs> Whoever is, can operate one of those things. Sorry. How you doing, sir? Well, obviously not too good. Okay, so you know my, my officers, we, we got called in for a crash. Okay. Go do what you got to do. I appreciate that, and um, we, we just have to walk through this. No, I understand. You know, we have to walk through this. Today no, I understand. And just, uh, I was taking my wife, uh, my wife home. We were at the Civic Theater tonight for a fundraiser. Okay. Somebody's wife couldn't take her home. Okay. So I took her home. Okay. Coming back. Either I had obviously too much to drink, or coming around at roundabout, which I'm not familiar with, I went over the line and hit somebody's uh, side view mirror. Okay. It is what it is. It I understand is. that. I, I really appreciate that. And, I, I, and I'm telling you right now, the way you're walking through this. I know it. I know it. It's, 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 it sucks. I but know, you know it sucks. It's, but the thing is, is if, if, we don't, if we don't follow the steps, if we don't do this you, thing you, the right you, way, you, it's, you it's, 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 it's going to come back. Oh, no, it, always, it always comes back. Yeah, the, so the so mayor, what we're going to do? We had a, a, a DUI or whatever you want to call it. So what we're going to do is we're going to give you a PVD, uh, oh, a yeah. breath, yeah. if you don't mind. We're going to oh, give no, you a formal breath test to see where you're at. There's one in the car over there. Okay. So we're just going to give you that. My we're, wife, we're, I was hurrying home. She's and she got home, right? We got her home. No, there in my home. So. Okay. Um, yeah, she's she's got. Uh, I don't know if you know that she's got. Okay, I didn't know that. Pain, okay. That's why I was okay. We'll we'll get we'll get her home. Uh, no, 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 no. That's, don't worry about okay. that. That's not so, to do with this. I was just in a hurry. Uh, also, Sorry. I suppose we're going to give you a. Ask you a thing. Big deep breath and blow. Probably four point zero. No, no. You'd be dead if it was four point zero. I know. I know. 
sir. I, I do appreciate your cooperation. No, okay. no. Uh, we have to do it. Okay. I, um, what is it? Well, it's it, it, you're, you're over the limit. What else do we need for That's second? about twice. It's about twice. Are we done with oh, the shit. Yeah. We can get them out of here. Yep. Let's go ahead and... Uh, Please. Who's, who's denying anybody? Please. Do what you have to do. Okay, I gotta take this. I gotta take this. Oh, oh my. Sorry, Go, turn around for me. Please. Put your hands behind your back. Hands behind your back for just a minute here. Yep. Yep. Behind your back. There we go. No, well, you're just being detained let, right now for suspicion of drunk driving, sir. Let go of your hands. Whose car is this? Mine. Hop in. Let's wait and see. He, exactly. he said go. Yeah, he already said yes, we're doing this. You're going to take me in? Well, Can you have a seat for me? Have a seat for me. You're gonna actually take me in. We're working through. Uh, we're we're waiting to see. Right now, you're just being detained. Can you please have a seat? Are you helping? Or are you good? No, no. I'm looking at your name. It's Asplund. It'll be on all the paperwork. I'm sorry. Asplund. Asplund. I understand what you're doing. I just want to know. I'll go with you. I'm not taking this. Hmm? I said, I'll go with you and help. I'm not taking this. Oh, I don't want this, you to take this. This is it. a joint partnership. Yeah, this, is, this is me getting fired. Is what it uh, is. Yep, I'm right there with you. He's asked my name like three times. Technically, I'm pretty sure you're supposed to be a supervisor in the community, but apparently that's not going to I'd please get a supervisor in the community. I'm going to get fired. And so are all of you, so it's been nice working with you. It's been a good three years. I might as well start looking for other departments now. We'll go back to school. Do we have a sergeant that's B90? I am not. I'm asking if we have a sergeant that's B90. Don't we need a sergeant that's B90 for this? Um, I was under the impression we were, but I could be all wrong. I will, I'm going to walk through this with you. Okay. Um, yeah, obviously, we're all <laughs> in the same boat here. Uh, I, yes. We just need a report from you. Um, we're going to get the wife, see if she could drive. Okay. She can drive. Who's working the car? Saying she had some kind of medical condition. So oh, where's he I don't at? know. He's in. He's, he's in, in this car. Do we handcuff him? Yes. Do we handcuff him behind him. Yes. Um, he told them to. Do it. Okay. If he, I was, if he's good, that's good. Okay. okay. I, I just. Mm, he's not. Good. He's not good with it. <laughs> he doesn't want to be handcuffed. He doesn't want to be in the car. So. And he's already threatening us. Yeah. Leave it the way it is now. Okay. I was going to do it a little bit differently, but we're good. We're fine. With I thought you said just go for it, and then you left, like so I didn't. Guys. No, 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 no. Listen, I was just going to hang up in the front and push COVID in the front. But we're, we're there, so it's, it doesn't matter. Um, let me find out from, I'm going to, Chief, just talking to Coleman. Cool. Okay. I'm going to talk to Coleman in just a second to how, I, either I'm going to walk through this with you, mm -hmm. and it's going to be my name on everything, with you running everything, if you're good with that. I'll do whatever you need me to. I want to walk through this thing. At so the end of the day, i got to do my job regardless no, and of who it is. We so. are, uh, yes, that's, uh, so you do your report the way you saw it. You did a perfect job, you know, like I told you. you know, we don't do this the right way. It's going to, someone's going to find out. Right. And he's going to come back to bite you one way or yep. another. Yep. And so uh, this way you can go face it and walk through it. Deep. Say I made mistakes and people can forgive He's not been read anything. Okay, Do we go want to ahead. read him? Yes, go ahead and start reading him. Gotcha. 
whoever's going to the careers, we need to get working on that. Because we've had a lobster. I can, I can do whatever you need to do. Who wants to do the B90? Nobody. As of right now. Nobody. <laughs> I can run it. You can run B90? Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. I want to stick with you and me. Okay. Because you can work the trash right now. Yep. And just document what he says. I got you. You can get a 5% and just start walking through this thing. If for some reason this thing starts, we can move things to the front and wrap it over. If that one comes in, it's going to stay there. It's going to make it better. You can't get it through the front, but then you can wrap it over. Uh, you'll put it over the front. Okay. So I'm gonna actually give that to the okay. All right. Is he in line? Yep. This one? Yep. So I'm gonna do this. Come on, sir. Put me in the handcuffs. Put the mayor in the back seat of the handcuffs. Sure. I won't forget this. Yes, sir. Believe me, I just want you to know that you are the court and everything. That's fine. I just cannot believe that it put me in the handcuffs in the mayor of the city. It's one thing, you know, to, to talk to me about, God damn it, these handcuffs are breaking my wrist. What we're going to do is, you have to go with handcuffs, okay? What we're going to do is we're going to move the handcuffs to the front, but we're going to have you sit back in the car. Okay, we're going to take your coat. Where's the chief? I just spoke to the chief. The chief said, I gotta do my job. And we already spoke about this. Okay? What we're gonna do is we're gonna take the handcuffs, we're gonna put them on the front. But we need your cooperation. Sir, just remember, you are recording. You are recording everything. I understand what you're saying. Okay. I need a side view mirror and this We are Sir, we are in the middle of something that we don't want to be in. I understand. What I'm gonna do is take the coat off. If you take the coat off, I was going to say, take the handcuff off first. Yes. Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to wrap you in. We're going to take your coat. We're going to take that off. Okay. We're going to take your coat and put the handcuffs back on. Go ahead and put them back on. And then we're going to wrap your coat over the top. I'm telling you this. Please. Make sure the belt locks so you're not Where's blocked. Where's my wife? We're going to get her home. She's still with me. Is she? She's your home. Yeah, she's still with me. Get her home. Go get her home, sir. She has cancer treatment. God damn it, get her home. Sir, I got this over the top, but you'll have to sit in the back of this car. Where is she now? She's in her car. Okay. Get her home. We will. We'll get her home. I don't. Sir, I'm not that. She's that far. You all work for me. Sir. Right? Please. Please. I'm serious. Officer. I don't care about me. Sir. Get my wife home. You will get your wife home. Listen. Right now. Sir. She is short of treatment. Get her home. Sir, I'm going to ask you to step into the car. Okay? We will take care of her. I will family. take her home. Sir. Not until I make sure my wife is on the right home. Sir, it's not your choice. No, me. I will take her home. I do. Just have a seat back in the car. Okay, please. You're reading? Okay. All right, sir. I'm just going to read a couple things to you, okay? The first is implied consent warning. Yeah, yeah. No, I understand. And it just says, I have probable cause to believe that you've operated a vehicle while intoxicated. Yes. I must now offer you the opportunity to submit to a chemical test. Yes. And inform you that your refusal to submit to a chemical test will result in the suspension of your driving privileges yes. for one year. Yes. If you have at least one previous conviction for operating while intoxicated, your refusal yes. to submit to a chemical test yes. will result in the suspension of your driving privileges for two yes. years. Will you take the chemical test? Yes. Okay. So the second thing I'm going to read... I'm sure you didn't know it, but it's just a warning of your constitutional rights, okay? 
First, you have the right to remain silent. Anything yeah. you say can and will be used <laughs> yes. against you in court. You yes. Have, you have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice before we ask you any questions. Yes. And to have him with you during questioning. Yes. If you can't afford a lawyer, one will be appointed for you for questioning if you wish. If you decide to answer questions without a lawyer present, you'll still have the right to stop answering at any time. Yes. You also have the right to stop answering at any time until you talk to a lawyer. Yes, ma'am. You understand each of these as I've read I them to do. you? Okay. All right. Let's get this guy. We have this. We're getting this car out of here. We're getting mom home. Make sure she gets in. Or wife. Make sure she gets inside and tucked away very, very well. Yes. Ask her if she needs anything. Need to call anybody? They're friends of the family. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so you and I are going to call. I'm calling you. Mm -hmm. We're going to B90. Is there a certain way we're going to take him in or anything? Do we want to have lockup staff come out and walk us back going, a certain no, way? No, let's just go in the way we're going. Okay. Because this is the problem we have. If we don't follow protocol, yeah. I, don't, I don't mind doing it, but they're going to have to, they're going to, have to check him. Have we checked him? Um, down, briefly. He's got what, like a stone. Okay. He just wanted to ask. Hey, sir. Okay. You don't have out for a minute. All right, I got, I got DJ on the phone. Okay. I'll, 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 anyway, DJ, that's where we are. All right, buddy. Yes, he's on his phone. Go ahead and get the phone off. All right, sir. Thank you. Here, we got to take this, sir. Well, that's okay. I just talked to PJ. Okay. You know the off him. We're gonna have to take everything out of your pockets. Here, we gotta check your pockets, sir. We gotta we gotta follow protocol on everything here, okay? I'll put them in a bag to keep them all together. And then they're are, are we going down to the county jail? I believe so. I don't think that's gonna happen. Can you turn around for a second here, sir? Somebody said they talked to the chief already. Yes, sir. Nobody. All right, sir, can you have a seat? You can have everything. Mm-hmm. That's fine. We'll go for the call. You know how it is, sir. That's how we got to do it. All right, you got to do what you got to do. All right. You're good. Just yeah, you're, you're good. good. Just uh, go what ahead and have, have, have a seat there. What do you want to do? have a seat there, sir. I'm sitting here. Yeah, just put yeah. your feet in. Can, can you go ahead and put your feet back, in and we'll, back we'll get the, going? Yeah. Yes, sir. Yep. Who, who talked? Who talked to the chief? I did, sir. I need to know who. Just Wilkins, officer. Who, Sergeant, Sergeant Wilkins? And we're doing the we're doing everything the, Steve, the correct Steve, way. Steve, okay. We're okay, doing right, everything. That's fine. That's we're fine. walking okay. through this. We got to walk through this, sir. All right, okay. We're walking Where's through. Where's my the, wife? We have her, sir. We we're about to. Is she on her way home? God, God damn sake! We were going to get home. We were, she's on her way home. We had to get your car out of here first before we I, get home. I don't give a shit about me. I'll watch give sir, sir, just watch yourself come watch in. We shut the door. All right, okay. Is somebody coming to pick this car? Yeah. Okay. We're going. Yeah. All right. Quicker we get done, the quicker we'll get you out of here. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, do what got to do. Just like five minutes, maybe. This is not exactly where I want to do more. Sure you want to make sure your pockets and that's just there. There's nothing there. Okay. But they have to make sure Don't take my beautiful grandchildren from my phone. No, nah, nothing like that. I can get one more done. Or I can get it now. Okay. Hey, you guys, I Don't take my money. Actually, my wife doesn't have Spend all the auction. <laughs> <laughs> I say, sir, if you're a married man, you don't have money to begin with. Oh man, we spent a ton of money tonight at the auction. That's all right. Don't put my, don't put my serious car at home. Never mind. Go ahead and take that.
Yeah. All right, sir. I know we read this in the we read this in the car. Oh yeah. I'm just gonna read it to you again, okay? okay so it's on so it's on this so camera. Yep. Yes. Yep. Put my it, camera up here. There's one there and there's one there. Okay. And there's here and there and I, there. I, I, I understand. <laughs> so this is just Indiana implied consent warning. It said I have probable cause to believe that you've operated a vehicle while intoxicated. I must now offer you the opportunity to submit to a chemical test yes. and inform you that your refusal to submit to a chemical test will result in the suspension of your driving privileges for one year. Yes. If you have at least one previous conviction for operating while intoxicated, your refusal to submit to a chemical test will result in the suspension of your driving privileges for two years. Having read that, will you take the chemical test? Yes. Okay, thank you. Never had one in my life. This is going to be no experience. We will walk you right through it, sir. I know you will. It's not, it's not too big of a pain. I get my picture taken. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. So, I'm also going to read you your constitutional rights yeah. again while we're waiting for this. Can I read it to you? Do, yeah, if you I want to. I still <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. All right. So you have no. the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in court. Mm -hmm. You have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice before we ask you any questions and to have them with you during questioning. If you cannot afford a lawyer, one will be appointed for you before any questioning if you wish. If you decide to answer questions without a lawyer present, you'll still have the right to stop answering at any time. You also have the right to stop answering at any time until you talk to a lawyer. Do you understand each of these rights as I've read them to you? Okay. With these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to me? Okay. I talk to my wife instead of you. <laughs> she, you don't want to talk to her right oh, now. Oh, no. I, <laughs> can I send a couple of nights? <laughs> oh, I'm a dead man walking. Did you have the, um, oh, well, his license? Yep, right here. Mind if I grab that for a second? Thank you. So basically, this is going to be similar to what we did down there. Sure. Um, where's the mouthpiece we'll put in here, and we'll just have you blow sure. into it like the bottom of the until we tell you to stop. I'm sure yeah. Oh, Lordy Moses. I, I kind of wish we hadn't just left the event. That would have been better. You know Those new licenses are great, aren't they? They give you your face all bleached out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think mine looks better in black and white. They're kind of finicky sometimes. Yeah, that's all right. You gotta have like a just nice long, yeah. long even breath. Okay. breath. Oh. I thought you wanted me to. No, 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 no. I didn't know, man. I didn't know. You probably got better lungs than me, sir. <laughs> I don't know about that. I'm an old man. And it's gonna make you do it one more time, gentlemen. Is that right? It, 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 won't the right. it won't. It won't tell us until yeah. the end. Yeah. But so you'll you'll, you'll, you'll you'll do two samples. Point oh seven. No, it does. Is that what you're saying? It'll provide two samples. It might be. And uh, the lowest of the two samples is the official. That's correct. So it makes us wait two minutes and we'll do it over. No, that's fine. And then we'll be done. All right. Oh, wait, pain in the ass. Are you recording this? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. What a pain in the rear. Okay. 
I think that they've heard asked before on the podcast. I'll make from, from, from one of the three of you. Oh, I was going to start on this on the small of the boys. Oh, that's bad words. So we're going to. Yeah, that's all right. That's the worst thing uh, about it. Cam Pierce tonight has tried the best night it's ever had. Oh. I've heard that just talking to two people on the phones. Are <laughs> I need to get home to my wife. And we did make sure she got home. So. Uh, uh, thank you very much. And she's uh, got some. Well, our prayers will be with her. Thank okay. you. Are you, uh, are we still on records? Yes, sir. <laughs> I'm going to ask you about uh, the jail, the new jail situation. Turn it on. Turn it Oh, well, that's the problem, sir. We can't. We can't. Uh, that's, the, that's the policy we have. Yeah, so, I, I, okay. Yeah, we get in trouble if we turn them off. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I understand. Colin Henderson's are in the hill of line, aren't they? Yeah, they, 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 uh, eight, eight of the places are denied or something like that, or? Well, I know where they want to go, and all of us know where they probably want to go. That's where the shirt's going to be different than where they will go, though. Yeah. Although they keep they keep turning down these six or seven places, they can at least come back and say, "Hey, we've done our research, we've done all this, and there's no other place." But they aren't there yet. One more, one more breath for you. We're gonna do this. Three, three one more I don't know if they have. Little anyway, okay. Steady. Just like before. Yep. Same as last time. Keep going, keep going, a little stronger. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. There you are, sir. Okay. All right, okay. we are all done. All right. What are we looking at? We'll, we'll get some out. Don't, don't get higher than it was before. It takes a minute. It'll I, read everything. I, 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 I and start print it out for us. Nice. All right. What's up? Yeah, it's just, it's running through its cycle. Okay, what I started doing is Phil's bright stone. Give me the English one. Right. How good are you with these? Yeah, I can do it if you want. Okay, yeah, if you want to. If you want to document. Something. Yeah. I will do. Oh, Jeff. What does that mean? That's so how it's, it... It's running through its system. Oh, I check some balances to make sure it's properly calibrated, sir. So while that's running through that... Oh, for God's sake, what copy, sir? <laughs> oh, my dad. While we're waiting for the results, I'm... I just... served in the military. No, no I, I just did the eyes, right? No, I totally understand. I'm going to do a couple more tests, okay? Sure. Do you mind coming back and standing against this line for oh, me? Not. Yes. All right. I'm just going to check your eyes first. You wear glasses or anything? No. Anything wrong with your eyes? No? Okay. You see the tip of my pen right here? Yeah. Okay. I want you to watch the tip of my pen with your eyes and your eyes only. Don't move your head, okay? Okay. All right. Are you good with that? All right, now we're going to go up and down, same thing. Okay. Don't move your head, just okay. follow it with your eyes, okay? Yep, watch that tip of my pen. Mm -hmm. I like your chest. <laughs> I see those. All right. All righty. So if you just want to hang out there one second. Yeah. I see those. Your tattoo? Ah, I found it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We're going to do a couple more if you just want to come. Yep. Oh, I'm sorry. You're good. No, just stand. Come off the wall a little bit. Oh, careful. Don't fall over. No, I just want to make sure I'm on the line. Yep, you're good. Just take a step forward for me. You're, this isn't part of the test. Just come step forward okay. so you're not against the wall. That's perfect. Yep. Right okay. There. That's just good. Just stay there. I didn't know right. I was supposed to do something. No, no, no. You're good. All okay. right. So this is called the one leg stand. Can you take your hands out of your pockets for me? Thank you. So, all I want you to do, you're, you're good. Which, which hand? 
both hands out of your pockets. Just put them down at your side. Okay. Perfect. I want you to stand with your feet together. Perfect. Just like that. All right. So please stand with your feet together and your arms down at the sides, just like that. And let me read the instructions. Don't start until I tell you to, okay? All right. When I tell you to start, I want you to raise either leg with your foot approximately six inches off the ground, keeping your foot parallel to the ground. So it's going to look like this. This. Yeah. Oh, don't start yet. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So stand. I thought it one You're good. Nope. Stand just like this. Okay. Perfect. So while holding that position, after you start, mm -hmm. count out loud 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, until I tell you to stop, okay? <laughs> Alright, so keep your arms down at your sides at all times. We don't start yet. Okay. So keep your arms down at your sides at all times, okay? Do you understand all those instructions? Alright. Let me go ahead and start. 1,002, 1,003, how many? Yep, just keep counting until I tell you to stop. Sorry. You're okay. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, 1,006, 1,007. You're good, just keep going. I can't do that until even when I was totally so. All right. Eight, nine, you're seven. you're good. You're good. Jeez, it's very good. Do we have the walk and turn or no? Yeah, perfect. All right, we're just going to do one more, okay? So you can go back to your place at the start of the wall. Perfect. Yep, right there. Just take one step off the wall. Perfect. All right. So this is called the walk and turn test. So I want you to take your left foot and put it on the line. Yep. And then you're going to place your right foot in front of your left foot. So it's going to look like this. One in front of the other, heel to toe. Yep. So hang on, don't start yet. Oh, I'm sorry. No, you're okay. So both arms down at your sides, feet on the line, left foot in front of, left foot, right foot, and just stand like that, okay, until I tell you to start. Okay. Yep, just come off the wall. Left first. No, don't start yet. Okay. So I just need to stand like that until I read all the instructions, okay? Okay. Come off the wall for me. Yep, take take a step off the wall. There we go. Alright. So when I tell you to start, you're gonna take nine heel to toe steps down this line. Alright? And it's gonna look like this. Yeah. One, two, three. And so on until you reach nine. Don't start yet. Oh, I'm sorry. Yep. So I was fired up. That's okay. When you reach nine, you're gonna take a series of small steps like this and turn around on the line, and then you're gonna take nine heel to toe steps back. Oh my explosion turned below there. <laughs> I'll I'll you'll walk you through it if you need. So it's just nine heel to toe steps down, and they're gonna around. turn around slowly and nine right. heel to toe steps back. Alright? And I need you to just count out loud while you do it. Do you understand all that? Okay. I think so. Okay, you can begin. One, two, three. Yep, watch your feet. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Answer the phone. Ten. One, two. Yep, three. heel the toe steps. Oh, sorry. You're good. Five, six, seven. Well, I guess I was one short. That's okay. We are all done with those, all right? All right. Can I spend a night here? My wife. I will take one of the And she will kill me. Be sorry. That's free. No. That's all we have. We're good on the first one. That's all we need. Yeah. yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. No. No. Sergeant. It's not. We just spend the night and. Michigan City. Yeah. How we do? All right. How do I do? We are all done, sir. You, your official score was point one five two. Yeah, that's just under twice the winning. Nice. Did you sign them all? Yeah. And did this one get me a minor? 
Sometimes you just don't know how much you drink sometimes. No, you know, you get pretty good. Yeah, it's just like those things. You get my phone and stuff like that. So, you know, I understand. You're like, you know. So I'm going to spend that night here. You're not going to price it. I appreciate it's, that. It's, it's, it's an, an OR charge. I'm sorry, I can't be here for a little bit. Sorry. Not for a little bit. I just want to make sure my wife is here. I care about making sure she needed everything, got her home, make sure that she needed anybody that we would contact her. Don't let me pinch your fingers, I'm going to open this no, no, door. No, no. Yeah, I'm going to get a family. Is it? It's still in the drawer. Right? 47 years of married, I think. And, uh, or is it one in the drawer? So those, I think, is one. Okay, then you get two. Yeah. I never remember. No pictures, I hope. You look very photogenic in your suit. I don't have my suit. You he's, just took it. He's got your jacket. Yeah, no, I don't want it. it. <laughs> you don't want it. We don't get any pictures. Today. You still look photogenic in your shirt. Why well, we don't get pictures? Today. I I don't even know. It, Let's not do that. No, this, this is the county show now, mm -hmm. sir. No, no, uh, well, I'll take care of the families. No pictures taken tonight. Well, we that's, not, that, that's not up to us, sir. I'm sorry? That's not up to us. Yes, it is. No, well, sir. It will be. Not up to you, but up to me. Sir, uh, I'm sorry. You really no, you. no I, I'm sorry, but this is a situation like that. The thing is, is we have to follow. I can't have my wife in there. Look, sir. We have to follow the protocol. I know, I know you do. I know. We have to follow the protocol. The I know. Listen, where are we going next? So, I know, I know. We're, we're, we're just wait here for just a second. Are we ready? Yeah, we're, we're ready. Okay, let's go. Where are we going next? So we're going to follow, you're going to follow this. We're going to go back out. Yeah, this, this is the county show now, sir. Well, I've got the best time to this. So, that's not that yeah, it is. Yeah. Are we, yeah, I'll, let me go. I'll give my hands up. Sorry. I'll, I'll, I'll come. I'll come. I'll come back. I'll come back. How do you guys want to do this? Is he staying? Well, probably not What's staying, but he's over. So we can. One five two. When do you guys arrest him? Like twenty minutes, half an hour ago. Oh. So he's got. He was one five two just now. He got six hours. Okay, I don't. Great. Here, the gentleman. Thank you. What I'm help to have to do when we get over here to the scanner, I need you. You need help? No bail. Oh, uh, I need you to take off the shoes. I'm gonna scan you. Promote me. They'll take off your shoes and you'll hold them and they'll scan you and then you can put them back on. Yep. Why not? You have a middle initial, sir? Sir? A middle initial? A C. That's an A. It's Thomas with an A. I don't like you.
Yeah, look at that red target right there. All right, you just take your shoes off. I don't know what y'all, what your protocols are for this. Mm -hmm. um, how y'all, how the sheriff wants to handle this. This is out of our hands. Mm -hmm. So I know that he's a one five. Mm -hmm. Therefore, he's supposed to stay here for six hours and 40 minutes. Correct. Gonna house him alone or get in contact with Okay, so that's that's set, that's set in stone for six hours and 40 minutes. That's legally we have to. Okay, that's all I need to hear. Um, can he have his coat or not? And then we have to also take his belt off. Yes. You're making this more difficult. I'm trying to, man. I'm trying to. Yeah. Okay. So what we're going to have to do, state law requires you to be here for six hours and 40 minutes. State law. No way around it. You're the, the, the level that you are, we have a, we, they have a cell to yourself away from everybody else. And we've been very specific to, to just get you in here. That's you easy. Talk to Steve. Huh? You talk to Steve. I cannot talk to Steve. This is state law. This is the county state law. This is state law. State law or county law? This is state law that you have to be here for six hours and 40 minutes. I just talked to the, the, their command, and you have to be here for that long. Who in your command? I don't know. I don't know who it was, but it's their jailer. They know their job. I can give you your coat back so you can stay a little bit warmer. Um, we are going to have to remove your belt at some point here when they get done with that person out here or getting them out of the way. We're going to remove your belt. I can give you your coat back, though. You're, we're, you're, you're, but obviously, we're, you're obviously taking all this. Yes, sir. Good. So we're about to remove your belt, but I can give your coat back, they said. We will put you in a cell by yourself. What time is it? It is... Uh, you took my watch? It's right after midnight, sir. I'm sorry? It's after midnight. Two after midnight. These are the things we have to walk through. I understand. And, and I understand. I, I, no, sir. No, sir. I can't talk to the chief. No, sir. I can't talk to the sheriff. No, sir. Not unless they are going to allow you to do it. You, who, you can who, speak who to them. Their lockup. Their lockup staff. They've already talked to their command. Already. And the sheriff and the chief it, both said I cannot talk to them. Yes, sir. We were just walking through it. If the sheriff or the chief wants to talk to you, they will have to contact you. And themselves. neither one of them have said no. I have not asked if they can contact you or not, but th we do not walk through this. He told me to do follow protocols. We're oh, following no, I'm not, protocols. I understand what your We're job following is. protocols. I understand what your job is. I, will I would like to talk to either the chief I will, of this is what I will, This is what I will do. I will talk to my command and let them know what every, what we have. It will be up to them if they, they are probably are going to probably, I would say, wall this off because they don't want to look like they have a hand in it because if they have a hand in it, guess what? You get a bad perception, right? It's, it's the way it is. Tell me about it. But this can, listen, the thing is this, I'm not telling you oh, how, Sergeant, I understand I, I'm, not, I'm not trying to I'm tell you how this I just want to make sure that the sheriff I will make sure. I will make sure both know that you're here. I, you're, I, here. You're, you're here. Yeah. I will. I will make. I, obviously, I, I admit that, uh, sir, thank you too much. Uh, sorry. Let's, I will make sure. I will call right, the chief. Right, let's do it. Let's let's do. I want to make sure there's nobody out here in the hall. We are good to go. Yep. I'll just go here, sir. Hold on, hold on. Hold on.
We covered the window, sir. Um, but we, we were going to have to ask you to sit I'm sorry? We're going to have to ask you to sit in here until they uh, release you, okay? Like according to state law, what we're required to do, you have to sit a minimum of what your BAC comes back to, okay? Which is how much? It's 1-5. It's 6 hours and 40 minutes. And there's nothing we can do about that. Starting since when? You're, you blew. Since you blew. I'm, I'm, since when? What time? 11.47. 11.47. I'll be until 6 o'clock in the morning. Uh, a little bit less than that, sir. Somewhere there. Does my wife know? Your wife knows you came with us, yes. Does she know how much time i got to be here? I will get her. God damn it, she's got medical problems. You know that. I will. I'm getting her phone number. I will call her and let her know how long you're going to be here. Who's the quadrant leader in this area? I'm the quadrant sergeant. Uh, uh, is, it, is it PJ or? No, or? this happened. Steve get, get hold of Steve. Have to get hold of me. Okay. What, do, now, you, do you want me? Have him. Have Steve. Sir. Get hold of me now. Sir, do you that, want me to? That's do, an order. Do you want me to call your wife and let her know how long you're going to no. be? Have, call Steve and have him get here now. That's an order. I will. This is what I'm going to do. That's an order. I'm going to call the you chief. What I'm saying. I will call the chief of police. I know what the, this position is right now. I will let him know. Either, either, either. Steve gets here or Steve gets here. Okay. Now. Sir, you've got to step aside. I don't care what time it is. Sir, you've got to step aside. I, I will. Thank you very yes, much. I'm sorry for these circumstances that we had to meet. here now. Yes, sir. I will let, I will let, I will let the chief know. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, sir. Can you hear me? Sir. Thank you guys for all your help. That's that was phenomenal. I mean seriously, I mean y'all made that smooth. As smooth as it can be, so I got a call. I got a phone call, so I gotta get out of here. Can I use your phone? Yo. Do I have to dial nine to get out? Are these recorded? They are. Okay. We're not even. I can't. I just can't get out of here. Your statewide news network covers Fort Wayne, where Mayor Tom Henry was arrested for drunk driving. According to his office, Henry was involved in a car crash. When police got to the scene, officers found that he was impaired. Well, he was then booked in the Allen County Jail and later released. Fort Wayne police did not provide any additional details about the arrest. I made the decision to get behind the wheel of a car after drinking at a local function. And I accept responsibility for those actions. Good evening, I'm Drew Fry. Thank you for joining us. You just heard from Fort Wayne Mayor Tom Henry hours after he was released from the Allen County Jail this morning. Henry is charged with operating while intoxicated. Here's what we know right now. Fort Wayne police arrested Henry just after 1145 last night after he crashed his car. He was booked into the Allen County Jail and released this morning. The four-term mayor called a press conference this afternoon where he read a brief statement in which he apologized to his family, his staff, and the citizens of Fort Wayne. I knew better. I knew better than to be in a position where there was going to be impaired driving. So today I am again here to apologize for my actions. Henry left the room without answering questions from reporters about his political future. Both city police and the administration have declined to release any details about the crash, including where and when it happened, citing the active investigation. Fort Wayne Mayor Tom Henry sentenced this afternoon for OWI four days earlier than initially scheduled. A city representative confirmed that Henry's counsel and the court system agreed to move the hearing to today. Henry will pay more than $3,000 in restitution and roughly $800 more in fines and court costs. His plea agreement is also part of the sentencing, which includes the suspending a year-long jail sentence. 
the city of Fort Wayne refusing to release police video from Mayor Tom Henry's OWI arrest. New tonight, a media law attorney tells us he's not sure the city has the standing to withhold the video. And Indiana's public access counselor says his office is investigating after receiving a number of complaints. Fox 55's Brianna Bias is live in studio to tell us more about the city's reasons for denying our request. Brianna. Yeah, Kelsey, the city of Fort Wayne says they don't have to release the dashboard and body cam video because they consider it an investigatory record. But I spoke to attorney Steve Key today, and he says since Mayor Henry pleaded guilty, that's the end of the investigation. So he can't think of a reason for them to not release it. A major development in our efforts to obtain the body camera and dash cam video of Mayor Tom Henry's drunk driving arrest. Good evening, I'm Kelsey Mannix. Thank you for joining us tonight. First reported by Fox 55 this afternoon, Indiana's public access counselor says the city of Fort Wayne violated the Access to Public Records Act by not releasing it. We, along with other local news outlets, have been working to get the video since Henry's arrest in October. And City Council President Jason Arp has also been vocal about the frustration with this issue. Fox 55's Brianna Bias spoke to him tonight. She's live now at the Allen County Courthouse with that response and more details about what that public access counselor said. Brianna. Good evening, Kelsey. Yes, Mayor Henry first pleaded guilty to drunk driving back on October 10th, and Fox 55 requested the body camera footage from his arrest the very next day. But the city attorney told us we couldn't have it because it was investigatory record. But in the public access counselor's opinion that was published today, Lucas Britt says Henry pleaded guilty, so that means the footage is no longer investigatory record. So they're violating public access laws by not releasing it. Fox 55 sent in a second request for the footage on November 4th after Henry's sentencing. They told us they received the request, but we have not heard anything from the city attorney since. And we are not only the ones, we are not the only ones who are asking for the video to be released. City Councilman Jason Arp is also trying to get it released and says this recommendation from, Bit, from Britt could help. Um, there's been questions about some of the circumstances that, that happened on the scene that um, we have no clarity as to um, whether or not those allegations are true or not. This will give us an opportunity to take a look to see if they were or not. Fort Wayne City Council members responded tonight to seeing the police video to Mayor Tom Henry's arrest. Put the mayor in the back seat of the handcuff. Sir, I'm going to have you step out. Councilman Russ Yale was the first to bring it up, saying he was disappointed by the mayor's behavior toward the officers. It's been a good three years. Yeah. I might as well start looking for other departments now. I support an independent council to review the footage and make a nonpartisan recommendation of what the council should formally admonish the mayor. Council President Jason Arp did not comment on the footage during tonight's meeting, but he did send Fox 55 a statement condemning the mayor's behavior as inappropriate. His main concern, the threats Henry made toward the officers. He says, quote, intimidation of city employees is something that we must take seriously, especially those who are tasked with enforcing the laws. Arp has not yet seen the entirety of the footage, but when he does, he says council will be able to determine how direct the threats really were. In police just released body cam video of the mayor's arrest back in October for drunk driving. Police say this video shows the mayor with slurred speech and unable to show officers his ID when they ask for it. And him ordering officers to take his wife and his mother-in-law home with lights and sirens. At one point, even threatening to get the police chief involved. This release came 10 days after the state found the city violated Indiana law by refusing to disclose the video to the public.